There is no meme. This is just a threat. I am really curious to see how this develops. But regardless of how it develops, it's developing without my consent. And that is... You know what? Let's just mercilessly slaughter all the Axe Knights, and then whatever Schmidt's up to, we can worry about later. Welcome back to FE4 Substitutes. In, in These are confusing times, to say the very, very least. Now, someone in the comments gave actually a pretty logical explanation of why these men are, like, why everything is as weird as it is. And I actually kind of believe it. And it all boils back to something stupid I did a while ago when I let a base get captured. People are saying that their AI is usually meant to take Ganyshire. Ganon, Gan, whatever. But since that's destroyed, they want to see Sophara. But the AI doesn't really know how to do it. So there's really, really awkward and janky pathing. I am willing to accept this as just what happens. Uh, Radney... Actually, let's have... 34, my... Let's have Johal Veer get a kill. Do the old fighter shuffle. And got him. The Paragon Band makes that really nice. I feel like I could be make Johal Veer a warrior on this map if I really wanted to. Alright. Um. So we do have a bit of an awkward situation with how these fighters are laid out. But I think the power of Selif will make it so that they'll they'll all probably die. Maybe not entirely this turn, but you know, like in general. Dimna is really doing pretty well, I gotta admit. If I can just get that boy a better bow, he'll be putting in work. Alright, level 5. Just as I was praising him. That's how it always happens, isn't it? You praise someone, and that's always when the crappy level up happens. Without fail. Alright, so, curiosity question. Can Tristan actually... He can't even reach him. Ha! Huh. Well, we'll see how this goes. We... Wait, 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 hang on. That looks a little... Can you... No, we're good. Femina and Amid are just not gonna get very much this map. I guess a mid can get that thing I left up there. Who knows? It's time for the next part of the thrilling Schmidt arc. I am not looking forward to it. Right. Isaac. Here it comes. You're go Why Oife? I have not yet gotten an answer to this question. Uh, okay. I mean, I guess it's saving Dimna's life. Still don't get it. But if we can wipe out all of these axe fighters, which I'm pretty sure I know that we can't, but if we could, then that means Schmidt is... Oh no, we literally can't. There are too many over there. 
Schmidt is going to turn around because Schmidt likes to get reinforcements. Okay. The weirdo nonsense continues. <clears throat> Let's start with Johal Veer absolutely weakening one of them. Ooh, nice dodge. Okay. Now, Rottlebon can go down and finish him off. And then if Radney gets a sibling crit, then she can kill one by herself. And that'll be really, really cool. It's up to, it's up to God. But I believe. Damn it. Okay. In that case, we're gonna need Dimna to finish him off. Which is fine. Dimna can do this. Yeah, you know, Dimna's got this. Dimna's got this. No world in which Dimna doesn't have this. Ow. We are continuing the Dimna objective. Uh, get you back there. Um, Seleph can honestly finish off you. Bam. Owie. Bam. And get a level up. Okay, see, Seleph's one of the good ones. He should get good stats here. Yep, perfect. Um, then Mana, heal him up. Bloop. Julia cannot reach Dimna, but Dimna also isn't going to be in, like, danger. Okay, now, honestly, I wouldn't be too angry if you crit. So, naturally, now is when you stop critting. Alright, let's just get you starting to move up. Alright, I would need a critical hit to activate here. Why has God abandoned me? I've also left a healer in danger range, but I'm pretty sure she's going to be fine. In fact, one of those so far can't make it. Okay, well... Cool. No, this is great, actually. Okay, okay. So far, uh... You're gonna heal up a little bit. That's not going to matter. But you are healing. Blah, 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 blah. Alright. Now time to see how this goes. Because Schmidt's going to seize that castle. Like, he's going to do that. The question becomes, what does he... Oh, well, never mind. Uh, uh, Mana is saved. Let's see, I can definitely get Radney a kill. And then if I just kill enough of these, Schmidt should turn around. Like, I'm fairly certain Schmidt's AI is set to turn around. Hannibal does the same thing in Chapter 9, where he just leaves the middle of what he's doing to uh, go get reinforcements. Okay, so that castle just gets seized. It doesn't get destroyed. Whatever, right? Like, whatever. Who cares? Yo, Halvir! Yeah, just weaken this guy. Yo, Halvir is really good at that. Ow. Oh, continue activated. Alright, well, I meant to say kill that man. 
I apologize. More bulk? Sure. Um, are you, like, injured in any way? You're not. Level 3, level 5. Dimna has just started taking experience. Like, he's becoming a big boy. Owie. You know, I just thought, what if Schmidt tries to conquer the home castle? Oife has the return ban, but that would be really awkward, and that is a fantastic level up for Dimna. Radney! Kill him dead. Got him. Okay, good, 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 good. Good things are happening. Maybe. Jury is still out on that one. Never mind, the jury is back in. Good things are happening. Oh, 42 7. Alright, so Tristan definitely wants this kill. Like, that's just going to happen. And now he gets the critical. Huzzah! Um. Oyfei's gonna back up a bit. To weaken this guy so that, uh, what's his nuts, Rottlebon, can get the kill. But we gotta be careful with Rottlebon. I can't get him over level 10. Thankfully, this is, like, that's not going to get him over level 10. So, Rattlebond, do this. Kill him! For some reason, I was worried he was going to get hit by that, even though that hit rate very clearly reads zero. Alright. Now, Selif isn't going to move... And now this hand axe guy is stuck. He cannot move. So Julia can run down here and heal up Rattlebon. She can get her second level up. Got magic. That sure is Julia. And then you can go over here for Dimna. And heal him. And then Femina can just fly on down, I guess. The hell is a mid dude? Oh, Schmidt might go after a mid. Because he's technically the closest thing. I have no idea what's about to happen. Uh, I do know that this guy's going to hit two 19% in a row. Sure. Why not? And now Schmidt's going back to get reinforcements. Okay. So I, I need to stop him from doing that. Which does mean having Oife... Really everyone just hoof it. That needs to be what transpires. Um, I can have Selif seize this bit. It's not gonna be the prettiest, but as long as I leave, like, Julia behind with him, he should manage to be okay. Level 3, level 3. Uh, let's, let's just give these two some time in the sun. Or both of them, actually. I meant to heal with Julia. I'm bad at this. Just unequivocally god awful at this. Actually, how about his Femina besiege? No! I'm not doing that. Well, it might level her up. And she can just fly away if this doesn't work, so. And then she can fly down to right here, and she can get healed. Ah, it's perfect. You know what, Ahmed? You you go up. No, no. Fuck that village on the top right. There we go. I should probably just have him go there. Alright. The Isaac phase 
Is he gonna heal all the damage Femina does? Not all of it! We- we have a strategy! We can keep attacking him! Two HP at a time, he will fall! Alright. Uh, Julia. Yes. Staff, mend. She is now fully healed. And can besiege once more. Go get him, champ! Nice! That is a level up. We're gonna get stats. Defense? Sure. Skill? More hit rate? Let's do it, baby. Alright. Oh, uh, hang on. Just gotta make sure. Yep. Okay. That's right. The road. I, I don't know the exact math on how much roads help. There are many things about this game which, uh, elude me, to say the least. Alright, Rottlebond's gonna keep schmoving. Dimna as well. Yeah, everyone's gonna schmoove on up. Staff, heal up Selif. Alright. Things have gotten a little crazy. But I think we're making it. It just costs Sephorian citizens their lives. But I can live with that, you know? Fuck them. Beautiful. This is exactly how combat should always go. I just... Am I gonna get there, Tom? I am. The problem... Well, it's not... It's kind of the problem. Oife is going to have to stand right there. Schmidt cannot be allowed to enter the castle. If I remember how the AI here works correctly, and I have been dumb before, if they can't enter the castle, they don't even attack. They just stand there, in front of you. So if I have Oife just stand there, he shouldn't have to deal with Schmidt and Dannon. He'll only have to deal with Dannon. And that is exactly what I want. So let's move you... Oh yeah, this talk conversation. Lord Selif... I think this is about the same. Right, no, this is pretty much exactly like Fee. Um. Yeah, weird feeling. Okay, that's about the same. If anything was different there, I don't have good enough memory to remember it. But, uh, don't. A C, Silver Sword. Oh, the Silver Sword's gonna break. That's not good. This, this is still gonna do plenty of damage. He might die to getting hit by two 25% in a row after he just got hit by two 19% in a row. If that wants to happen, let it happen. The world is to change, let it change. If my fate is to be destroyed, I'll simply laugh. I should play Chrono Trigger again sometime. Let's see it! I hate this channel. No! No! There we go, okay. He did good. He did not get hit by two of those back-to-back. -back. More strength is nice. Could use more speed, though. Definitely would like some more speed. Actually, come to think of it... Schmidt can't reach Dannon right now. That's good. 
So maybe... How long is it? How many turns have I been here? 36? I'm pretty sure that the conversation between the two of them should have happened by now. But I digress. How well does Oife handle... I mean, his attacks are going to be automatic crits. But he does have Pavice. Oife is our best bet. But is he our best bet when we don't have a healer up here? That's the problem. Mm. Thirty-four. You know what? I'm looking at you. Yeah, let's just put you right here. And see if he does what I think he does. Alright. Uh, Julia... Mend the boy. Besiege. Now you can use the silver sword and just fucking kill him. Perfect. This can get Julia her Nosferatu. Uh, later, apparently. Alright. Woo! Amid. Get on up there. Okay. Just past the absolutely obliterated ruins of Ganelshire. Alright, so he doesn't attack. I was correct in that. Which means I'm actually free to just do this, aren't I? Hold, rebel scum! King Denon has decreed that I suck dick. Very good, very good. Just equip the Armor Slayer and wait. That might be really dicey. But I, I'll be able to manage. If Schmidt does decide that he wants to attack with things, I'm going to be fucked. But... Uh... This... This shouldn't change at all. We're ecstatic to see you! Thanks for saving us! Congratulations! Isaac is now yours! Woo! Now, I believe Julia has to either talk with... Yeah, she talks with Selif... And now she has the power to defend herself. Woo! Because Isaac apparently had the Nosferatu tome in there somewhere. Fine by me. Uh, amid, where are you? Amid all this chaos. There we go. All right. I'm pretty sure Schmidt will not attack. Granted, Oife is gonna be going through it. Alright, did I say Oife was gonna be going through it? I meant to say that Oife is just built different. He's built better. Uh, he never was in doubt. Uh, L plus ratio. Alright. Now, ideally, Yohal Veer would get this kill. 34 minus 16 is 18. I would need him to be down to 18 health. Which is doable. Just not very comfortably. Dimna's doing a fantastic job of not missing, though. Okay, and then after that, Tristan will probably just die to the Brave Axe. And by probably, I mean he will. Because he'll only do two damage. 
and then die. So if I besiege, not besiege, attack, 34 minus, that'd be 19 times 2. Yohal here, Yohal would also die from the attack. Which isn't good. Get fucked, Dannon. Alright, Oife can have a little bit of a kill as a treat. And an amazing level up! Let's go, baby! Now, Schmidt still shouldn't move. So I should theoretically be able to just keep babying until I get the kill. What does the armory have? Just a bunch of iron weapons. I don't need those. You don't need that. No one needs anything right now. Except the Brave Axe to be in Yohalvir's inventory. I wonder if I specifically have to have Yohalvir wait next to Radney. And that's why the event hasn't triggered yet. I wonder if that's it. That might be it. I think. Could be wrong. Alright, Iron Bow, you should be able to weaken this guy. Alright. We just keep doing that until he's low enough for Yohal Veer to kill. And that's all we gotta do! And then I need to think about who I want to visit that village. Everyone is poor. That is an unfortunate side effect of how these things start. I think Dimna should visit that village. Because Dimna's gonna need the money. Right. I believe. Could be wrong. Alright, the Revo phase, Schmidt is still not going to know what the hell to do with his life. But that's okay. I think you only need to hit one more? Maybe two? Yeah, you need two more. Alright. As long If Dimna just lands one more attack, then I can just keep resetting... Until, uh, what's his nut? Yohal Veer doesn't get hit and die. Oh, if it isn't Lord Seleph himself, we can't thank you enough for all your help. Here, allow me to give you my granddaughter's hand in marriage. We raised her as well as we can be, and she's the kindest, sweetest little thing. Oh, I remember that even as a kid, she... Grandpa, knock it off! I'm sorry, Lord Seleph. I wouldn't wish seeing that sorry display upon anyone. If you do like me, my lord. Er, but wait a moment, this isn't why I'm here. <laughs> it's just a joke. A J-O-K-E. Look at how gone- uh, look at how bright red you are. How adorable. I love when these games get to be silly. But the grandpa has to know he was being serious. If I can't have your granddaughter's hand in marriage, I'll take $3,500. That sounds like a fair trade-off. That event is completely missable if you send someone other than Seleph to that village. I just like to show it off because it's it's charming. It's enjoyable. Just don't miss again, Dimna. Alright, you know, you did hit like every single 68. So you were due to miss some. Alright. Uh, bu -bu bum Just, there we go. There we go. And Dimna's getting some defense and skill. It'll help him in the arena, not really anywhere else. Okay. Steel Axe. 
If this misses, he dies, and then we'll just reset until it doesn't. It didn't miss. Alright. The Brave Axe is in Yohalvir's inventory, which is where it needs to be. The... Oh, more skill is actually pretty good, because his hit rates are shaky. So, Yohal Veer basically has everything he needs until the end of the game. Um... Yeah, you can go over here and we can cheese some healing experience? Bloop. Leveling up. Cool. And Selif is just gonna keep on moving. Julia doesn't need to do anything. Amid, your your job is done. Now I'm actually going to look something up here that I don't fully understand, because there's an event for having Yohalvir wait near Radney. And I need to see why I'm not getting it. Ba ba da ba da. Let's stay next to Larce for 10 turns. So do I, do I just have to hit end turn with them not moving for 10 turns? Is that it? Is that how that goes? Well, let me see if that works. Dimna can now afford... New bows. Alright, now Seleph can seize. So yeah, let's have them not move for 10 turns. And see if that works. Something's... Something's not right here. Ah. Let me try it like this. Here it is! Knock it off! I don't want you hovering around me like I'm a lost pup. It's irritating! Oh, uh, I just thought I should protect you. Ugh. Okay. She got so mad, she gained two strength and three luck. Absolute power play. I can finally leave. This was, without a doubt, the most botched, peculiar handling of Chapter 6 I've ever seen. But we got it. We're good. We're moving on. Onward to Chapter 7, which has been on record as my least favorite chapter in the game. But now we'll have Daisy and, uh, Jean, I think her name is? <coughs> oh, oh, God. Something in my throat there. All right. Leaf is going through some stuff. And then... There she is. That's just Nana's line. Near the church. Now I'm curious to see how this is going to go. Because... Leaf and Nana have not... Well, Nana has not been bred to be anything. She's dead. So I wonder if having a substitute will actually make this difficult. I also don't remember what I left Finn and Leaf with. I think Finn does have his Brave Lance. But I could be completely wrong. Anyways, introduction for Daisy. Oh boy, those rumors weren't kidding. That place was full to the brim with treasure. Been a long time since I've had a haul like this. Can't afford a doll now. Gotta get out of here. And quick. <laughs> I love how much faster Shannon is. You can keep everything else, but I need this. 
Hard-earned goods. Hey. Listen. Stealing is okay on some circumstances. Alright. So that's gonna... Okay. We have seen the scenes. And now we're over here. This is gonna be the exact same. So! Do you know what time it is? It's time for the arena!